Welcome back there, you guys. Are you guys actually just singing an all-star from what I'm hearing? <laughs> Simply press smash mouth. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back. Most chill yet chaotic fan base I've ever seen. Yes, I, I bring the chill and then like random and his empire brings the chaotic. <laughs> oh, welcome back, you guys. Um, so we are on day 23 of spring, year two. Um, on Buttfruit Farm. Um, and we only just played yesterday and already have forgotten what we've done. <laughs> so that's always great. Um, I have turned on the recording for people on YouTube later on, which is great. Um, I've changed the stream title, I think. Yes, I did. Awesome. Um, so we're good to go. Did I miss All-Star? You did a little bit. <laughs> No worries, exertion, or exhaustion. Exhaustion, where's I getting that from? Welcome back. And the Crescent Switch, what do you think of the Lion King? I'm assuming you mean the new one. Uh, so tomorrow is the flower dance. Uh, I don't... <laughs> Will the wizard dance with me? Ooh, maybe we could get Sebastian to dance with me. How many hearts do you guys need? Or do you guys think we need? I guess I should say. Also, let me turn up the audio a little bit, I just realized. It's probably a little bit quieter than I like. Uh, Mhip, welcome on in here. How are you doing? And yes, people saying hello to YouTube. Is it only four? Nice. And Alex, hello. How are you doing today? Welcome on in. Managed to get covered in coconut oil. Thought it was all solid. I was wrong. Oh no. Pepper, what are you doing with the coconut oil? Well, we're getting together for the flower dance. If you find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. There's a little clearing behind the forest west of town where we hold the dance. Arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you're interested. So you watch the OG Lion King. Oh heck yeah, you do. That movie's so good. Oh, I see, Pepper. Are you gonna be on YouTube? Yes, you are. I mean, technically anyone in chat will be at this point. <laughs> Worked a seven day week, but I'm off for two days now. My goodness. Kudos to you. I don't think I could do it without losing it a little bit. Um, alright, so. Let's go ahead and put everything away. Now you have a Stardew Witch. Everyone join me. <laughs> Luigi is a dance partner. Luigi is best dance partner. Look at me. My mom's books are basically Disney movies, but in book form. You know what? I, until recently, I thought I had dreamt those up, but I'm pretty sure I had a couple of those growing up as well. And they were like larger books, but like had stories or I guess, yeah, stories from multiple Disney movies. It took you more than three in years in game to get a girlfriend there. That's fair. Honestly, sometimes it takes a while. I'm purposely going through with the uh, slow, sorry, with the save, uh, save file, but to each their own. Some people like to focus on other stuff, and that's cool. What's the point of this game? So, essentially, Stardew is a farming RPG um, with kind of a, some dating sim elements thrown in. Um, there's also fighting monsters, there's uh, resource gathering, their skill building. Um, if you've ever heard of or played the Harvest Moon series, it's very, very similar. Um, and yeah, you can you can do anything you want, really. You could play through the game the, and I use quotation marks, good way. You could play through the bad way. Um, you could not farm at all. You could just go mining if you really wanted to. However you want to earn money and, and make this profitable, you can. <laughs> um, it's a lot of fun. Yeah, Andrew. <laughs> Sell out to Jojo. Yeah, that's the bad way. The good way is the whole story is your grandpa has passed away. He left you his farm and he wants you to run it and help out around this town. Uh, the town has, um, 
uh, what's the word? I, like a community center that needs to be fixed. And to do that, you donate stuff from your farm and stuff that you can get in the mines and stuff like that. And eventually, the town is saved from being overrun by this company called Joja, essentially. And that's like the good ending. Uh, or I use the term ending lightly because this game doesn't really have an ending. <laughs> But it's fun. You'll you'll sink too many hours into it. <sighs> Them little switch consoles have Animal Crossing pictures. Uh Alex, you mean like the profile pictures on the Switch, maybe? Okay, so this section is still being worked on. Also, how's audio, you guys? Is that loud enough? I want to make sure you guys can hear this soundtrack. I was listening to the Kingdom Hearts streams and I was like, I could have turned up the audio a little bit more there. <laughs> Great to waste my life away with a game that isn't Animal Crossing. I hope you enjoy it, because... Lord knows I put too much time in. Audio's good, thank you, you guys. <laughs> um... I could go mining again today. It's really dangerous for me to go there, but... Undergirl, this, this soundtrack you're hearing right now uh, was actually from Undertale. Um, it's modded into the game. Do I watch my own streams? Not usually, no. Um, when I'm uploading one, say for example to YouTube, I make sure that the quality is okay, so I'll like click partway into the video and like Listen to it, make sure there's no audio distortions. Um, I don't like seeing or hearing myself. <laughs> um, but I do that just to make sure it's a good viewing experience for you guys. Um, and that's how I noticed the Kingdom Hearts one earlier today. Oh, my phone just went off. Oh, Ark, didn't it? <laughs> I've never really paid much attention to it before. Yeah, it's random, Lizzie. There you go. Random just posted it for you. Uh-oh. I hear one. <laughs> Hi, friend. There we go. I need to line up that, line that up better. Clearly she's not drunk enough. <laughs> we are not giving Pam beer, you guys. Yet. Queen of Sauce and drinking the wizard's soup. Yeah, the, the wizard is special. He's a he's an interesting character. Kinda lurking, kinda not. No worries, no worries, that's 100 percent fine. Oh gosh, I hear another one. Oh, oh, there you are. Hi, friend. There we go. Needs a pale ale, yes. <laughs> Ooh, actually, speaking of our quests, he wants us to get to 25. Here wants sashimi and maple syrup, which we actually will be getting really soon, so. Or we already have, technically. I'm just not getting it yet. Mining earlier, my health was so bad the moment I went to the next level. There's a slime on that square. Oh gosh. Yeah. I've I've had there's some really cheap things in this game like that. Uh I think I saw someone earlier on the Discord posting about how they got a ring from one of the enemies, but it went inside the wall and you, they couldn't get it out. Love the skull cavern elevator mod, it's so handy. It's very handy, but I don't know if I don't know. I kind of want to see how far I can get down myself. And then I'm gonna install it, maybe? Oh, I might die here. Maybe not. I don't trust myself. Every time I listen to music, I imagine. An editor animation. Oh, that's really cool, though. Uh... I was wanting to restart Stardew. 
when a new Smappy is about to come out and all the mods I'm about to update will need to be updated again. Yeah. <laughs> I know that pain. There we go. That took us forever to get to floor two. Lost the big light ring to the wall. Glitch before? Yeah. It's a little bit frustrating. It's something I'm really hoping that they might think about working on in the update, but I guess we'll see. Oh, why was I blaming Ark for my deaths? I don't remember this Ark, to be fair. <laughs> oh, hi, friends. No. Oh gosh, I see another one right there. Oh gosh. Oh jeez. <laughs> I don't like those things at all. I'm so bad against them. Oh whoops. You're d you know what, Adam? I don't think I've had my animal get stuck in the wall before. I've had them do some weird stuff, but not getting stuck. I've seen it before on, on the Reddit though. Ark, I don't know what happened. <laughs> you don't blame me. I don't know. I don't- I don't- I- Pain in Um... There we go. There's a lot of gold up here. Oh gosh, I hear another one. Leave me alone. Let me mine in peace, please. I'm forgetting my buttons for this game. I'm sorry if I'm mashing randomly. We're getting a lot of gold, so that's always really good. Your child was stuck on a wall for a while until he grew. <laughs> See, if someone was coming in here and they either didn't know Stardew, or didn't know that we were talking about Stardew, that, that would be a really weird sentence to read. <laughs> oh gosh, oh gosh. Hey. Oh gosh, not now, friend. Oh. Well, that was handy. Just gonna go on down there. <gasps> Pepper, what type of ice cream are you eating? I would go for some ice cream right now. I don't think we have anything but plain old vanilla ice cream in the fridge. And generally, I'll only really have vanilla if it's like soft serve. Why is everyone eating ice cream? That's what I want to know. Wait, random, you were eating ice cream with chewing gum? Gosh, oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh my gourd. I didn't die. Dairy free Ben and Jerry's brownie flavor. Very nice. Screwballs. It's a cone of ice cream with a gumball at the bottom. I've heard of like a nugget of chocolate at the bottom, but I've never heard of a gumball in ice cream before. That's really different. Also, Salty Sabrina, welcome on in here. Um, if you have any questions about the mods, hopefully I can. Help out. I think the only good thing about killing those, uh... Rayquaza looking friends is that, uh, I've been getting a lot of bombs. Oh gosh. Oh. I get some ice cream later. Do you have Neapolitan? That's always good. Can you kill those other flying bugs around or no? No, I think they need to be killed with a bomb blast, I believe. Um, they're really weird about, like, for example, I do zero damage. I think if I hit them with a bomb, it might kill them though. And switch but have been curious about starting mods on pc i like the stuff you've got thank you yeah i try and keep it generally fairly minimal and like just kind of like ui changes but 
Yeah, it's, it's one of the benefits for PC Stardew for sure. Although I also play on Switch and it's still pretty good. So, random, sorry if I missed it. What flavor is the ice cream itself? Oh gosh. I think that thing is stuck in the wall over there. Oh, there it goes. Just need to- oh. It's almost linked to my walking? When I started moving it would free itself. That's different. Oh, Sammy, yes you do. It's so much fun. Okay, let's see. Fell down three levels, so we're on 12, I think? Oh, don't- don't water things. My goodness. Oh gosh. Gosh. There we go. I'm gonna go back where the slime can't reach me. Me. <laughs> Leave me be, please. Okay, I'm just gonna go down. I wanna try and get to those iridium floors. Because I don't think we've seen any yet. Pepper. Sting, hello, how are you doing today? Welcome back. Also, random, sorry, I just saw Raspberry Ripple. That actually sounds pretty good. Oh gosh, please leave me alone. <laughs> Someone let me invade their farm. <laughs> I I wish you could play with more people at once on Stardew, or else I'd be interested in having viewers. Maybe not join on this farm, but a different one. But uh it would it would get complicated real quick. Come on, I heard you. There you are, friend. Okay. Well, we got a lot of we got a lot of gold that round, which is really great. Um, some decent copper as well. Ah, oh, Celsius Arena. I'm actually just in the very beginning of year two. Um, and I kind of feel like I've been going a little bit slower on this farm than I have with my previous ones. Um. Oh, wow, Ark, you're right. That really does not line up. <laughs> but, um, it's, it's been fun. Local multiplayer games for Switch. Um, the only thing I know is that Minecraft works really well locally on the Switch. Um, when you start playing with other people further away, it starts to get a little bit more dicey, but... I meant to put this in here. There we go. Guns over beauty. Hello. How are you doing? Welcome on in here. There we go. Um, and I should be good to go on that front. Excuse me, kitty. Why is there a scroll in there? Huh. No worries, Ender Girl. You have a fantastic rest of your day. We'll see you later. Okay, so... Um, we're having kind of a bad day from the looks of it. 
Kisuke, hello, welcome back. But it is also the uh dance thing, so. Uh found this recipe in a magazine. I thought it sounded interesting. Feel free to give me a taste if you make it. I'm Shane. Nice. Oh, how was Sugar's stream? I think was she just was she shiny hunting today, I think? But yeah, I'm doing pretty good. The, the Luthian? Am I saying your name right? I'm sorry if I'm not. Welcome on in. Still no Oddish. Oh my goodness. I like I can't believe how incredibly patient she is. I I wouldn't be able to stick through, especially with the um softer setting of shiny hunts. Uh you moon, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome on in. Was an actual witch and was wondering why you were so chill with the witch just chilling on your farm oh no that's actually funny though yeah no those are uh i think they're called rare crows they're essentially just special scarecrows you can collect in the game but it took me a moment to figure out what you meant i was just like wait a minute <laughs> friends of ruby thank you yeah this farm is it has, a, it has a little ways to go still, but I'm pretty happy with the progress we've made, especially recently, for whatever reason. Within like the last two streams or so, I feel like we've done a lot. Okay, so we'll get another harvest of strawberries in a couple days, and then we can actually start planting <laughs> more of them later on next year. Um, but if you guys are just joining us for the first time for Stardew, uh, pretty much what I've been doing is every time I get a new animal, I've been naming it after someone in chat. Um, and so far we've had some very cute names. <laughs> get back into shiny hunting, still want that shiny dodo. I was honestly very tempted. I think I was watching Sugar the other morning. I don't remember when it was exactly, and she was shiny hunting for something. And I really... I. I booted up Let's Go again, and then I just kind of stopped, and I'm like, I have to play Mario Kart later on today. I think it must have been a Wednesday. Um, and I knew I would lose my progress if I, like, save and quit, so. Lizzie, you enjoy rest. <laughs> we'll see you later. I took my farm using the planner yesterday. It is so helpful. It's incredibly helpful. It's very nice to know what you're doing with everything. Right. Event day. <laughs> Ooh, these are done now. Okay, uh, before I go, I'm gonna really quickly just sell those. I wonder if strawberry wine sells for more. Mario Karting with us is amazing though, exactly why I wouldn't want to miss it. Um, so this is cranberry wine. And I'm gonna... I think I have seven in total. By the way, tomorrow is Wednesday. Tomorrow is Wednesday indeed, and we are still not certain if Crash Team Racing is gonna work properly for our, like, after Mario Kart time, but I guess we'll see. No, don't eat it. Oh, uh, well, Adam, I bet you got really good at catching Doduos, though. <laughs> Wednesday equals aggressive Mario Kart day. Yeah, we go from playing really chill Animal Crossing and, like, Stardew and, like, flip on over into Mario Kart where, like, the red shells are flying. <laughs> um, did I get the rare crow from this last year? I can't remember if I did or not. 
I don't remember seeing it on my farm. Hydrangeas, hello, how are you doing? Welcome back. Either way. Let me see if Sebastian will dance with me because let me have my moment, alright? <laughs> Ugh. Yes, ask Sebastian to be your dance partner. You want to be my partner for the flower dance? Okay, I look forward to it. <gasps> yeah, Judge Rules, I actually own it. Um, and I know a couple other people in stream do as well, so I was planning on having Mario Kart and then for like two hours and then after that switching on over, but the online for Crash isn't really re like reliable just yet, so... Okay. Lewis, let me dance with him. And guys, do you remember how we beat Abigail at the Egg Festival the other day? I'm pretty sure we just kicked Abigail out of dancing as well. <laughs> but apparently my part or my character didn't get the memo and didn't wear a pretty dress for this event. I'm not even in time with everyone else. What am I doing? I'm not even in line with them. Why is there a black bar on the side of my screen? What is this? <laughs> it's a Ouija hat. You have to have How is the Lion King? That was fun. Time to go home. <laughs> oh, it's that crossing. I feel that. Um. Okay, so this is all good. Pikmin lover, have a fantastic day at work. We'll see you later. Budweiser are doing pretty good. How about you? Stardew is going really good. We are slowly kind of forming the farm, I want to say. It's like not quite there yet. Um, stuff like this, like trees that I need to finish. Ooh, okay, I need one tapper. Um. Uh oh, there's stuff growing back there. <laughs> Oh, I need two tappers. Okay, I need two tappers really quickly. Oh, Jezreels. Yeah, Crash is really fun. I, I'm terrible at it, mind you. Um, really, really bad at, at the game, but I, I, it's satisfying to play, I want to say. Especially the drifting. The whole scenario is just an accurate representation of me every day. <laughs> Oh, I feel that. One of my least favorite Disney films since I'm not a fan of the music, but all things considered, I liked it. That's good. That's really good. Oh, Budweiser, very nice. Which, uh, which platform are you going with? There we go, and there's one tree up here that also needs one. There's one right here. Only caught horned elephants on this darn island in the last 15 minutes. Yeah, um, I wasn't having very good luck when I was on the island earlier. So, yeah, Adam. Yeah, I'm happy that we at least got it somewhat working. But Switch, very nice. I hope you enjoy it. It's a good game on the Switch. I'm honest. I'm not gonna lie, you guys. When I finish streaming, which isn't for a little while, but when I do. I might honestly just go and start a new save all on my way. <laughs> I've just been in a Stardew mood today. Uh, won't we'll wait till the trees are in sync, but the fact is there's some trees that have to grow right now, you're just wasting it. It's fine. It's fine. I'm in no rush. Zero rush. I also, I honestly don't ever sell that stuff either. I know some people are saying, oh, like, you know, I make a lot of money off of it, but I I just hoard it, so it'll all just be sitting in there anyway. Play my old farm on my Switch. <laughs> you got the itch? Yep. Already is addicting, and then when you watch someone else play it or you hear someone else talk about it, you're like, oh man, I gotta be playing too. <laughs> 
Max, hello. Pepper. Or Pepper and Max, that's very tempting. <laughs> if you do, would you start with a different farm layout or the standard one? I'd probably start with the monster one, actually. Um, it's another, like, very large open field, but it has monsters at night. <laughs> I like I like having a lot of space for everything. Never done. Yeah, we were talking about that earlier, actually. A lot of people in here haven't had the chance to experience multiplayer. And maybe that's just something, you know, we need to organize over the Discord where you guys can actually, you know, get to know other people, play with each other. Just because I totally understand not having people to play a game with. I didn't have anyone to play Animal Crossing with. Until I started doing YouTube stuff, so <laughs> I get it. Save on the monster land. I'm trying to make it look like a spooky farm. Really nice. Andrew, you know what? I really want to enjoy this forest farm, and that was actually the first farm I tried when that update was released. But I just- I can't get into it. There's not enough space for me. Everything feels like... Like it's all together, I guess. Uh, Reesey, hello. How's it going? Welcome on in. Adam, low-key, my default is Bronco. It's not very creative in the slightest. Okay. Um, so we're having a good day today, so I might do mining again and hope that I can get down a bit further and actually bring some bombs with me. My cat is sleeping in my potatoes, because what's new? <laughs> uh, DJ Kayla, hello! <gasps> Ark, giving me them Final Fantasy vibes. Um... So let's bring some bombs down. This is a really bad idea, mind you. I shouldn't be allowed to have bombs. Um, and I'll also bring down some extra food. Of some kind. I'll just bring down a whole lot of those. No worries, Max. Take your time. Damn. Pam, Pam, it's 10 p.m. Hello? Yeah, I got Dev. I've actually seen that method before. Um, it was quite interesting to watch. Where's Pam? It's not an event day today, right? Pam? No, Alex is there. Yeah, I got Dev, yes. <laughs> uh... Hi. Um. Is that normal? Does she just get hung over and won't actually go? Because I've never seen her do that before. I want to go with the thing. I'm having a good day. <laughs> Kent wants a catfish. I don't think I can go without her there. Please return when the bus driver is present. The bus driver is hung over. Oh man, my good day is ruined. <laughs> okay, I'll just, you know, spend it on the farm and wallow in my in my own farm. Um, <laughs> no. Um, let's go ahead and put some stuff in the furnaces here. because I'm running out of copper from all the uh, tappers I've been doing. And let me also grab my axe here. Not possible to take the bus on spring 25 due to Pam's appointment at the doctor's clinic. Pam is drunk at home, alright? She's not even going to the doctor. I called BS on that one. Oh well. That's interesting though. I don't think I've ever noticed that, but I, I very rarely go to the desert. Um... When I'm playing by myself, I tend to 
have to go more often than when I'm playing with others who usually do it for me. <laughs> button oh my goodness I'm pressing the uh, Dragon Quest builders buttons sorry you guys <laughs> at least we don't really I don't feel like we have to worry about wood very much on this farm We've, uh, we've chopped a lot of trees and we have a lot of trees still available to us. Dragon Quest Bildus. <laughs> um, does anyone know off the top of their head what it would take to upgrade my house? Is that something I want to be doing right now? It's currently on stage one, by the way, if anyone is curious. Or I could upgrade a barn. Starting to regret that all nighter you pulled. Oh no. Yeah, I, I was in bed super early last night and I'm very happy I did that. <laughs> um, my sleep has been terrible recently though. 10k gold, 450 wood. For which one, you guys? Sorry, just to make sure. I asked two things. I shouldn't have done that at once. Oh, Adam, if you enjoy Minecraft, I'm just saying you're going to enjoy that game, probably. It's a lot of fun. Uh, there's a demo in the eShop if you want to try it for the Switch. First upgrade is 10k and 450. Is she still open right now? I'll go see if she's still open. Karina, yeah, it's amazing. It honestly is. Yes, loner forever. Yes, we, uh... We finished what we wanted to do in Animal Crossing, and I figured I might as well start adding in a little bit of Stardew during the week. Um, I just- I have a Stardew itch, so... I don't know if this is technically closer or not, but... It's not that bad, Yup Dev. It's not that bad at all. Uh, yeah. There we go. Awesome. So we spent 10k. We still have a lot of money left. I'm not feeling that hurt about it. And as for wood, I was literally in the middle of chopping down more. <laughs> um, and we have we have a decent amount of hardwood as well. I think so. I believe we do at least. I think my music mod just died. Oh, no, there it is. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, we have enough hardwood. For just that upgrade. So you can have babies, but for me it's all about that exterior. Yeah, I, uh, I'm not planning on getting married or anything like that for a little while in this game. Um, I kind of want to go through and make friends with everyone in town first and then worry about that, so that upgrade probably won't be coming for a little while. Uh, actually, you know what? I like. I could do that. <laughs> I probably won't. I could just upgrade early. I think one day on stream... I wonder if Twitch would allow me to do this. I want to do like a Stardew Valley planner stream. <laughs> like not even the full stream, just like part of it. And kind of show you guys the map that we have right now. Like an overview of it and then see like, okay, this is where I want this to go. We should move this here. Yeah, Karina, it's acting up a little bit recently and I do wonder if there's been an update or something that just kind of did something. When Stardew gets streamed, because when I'm feeling too lazy to hold my Switch, I can still scratch my undying Stardew itch. I love that. I appreciate that a lot. Yep, 
You may fall in year three. Yeah, gamer pie. Like, I always like to tell people, you know, I have my fishing fully upgraded, but I still have that beginner fishing rod. I never bothered <laughs> to upgrade. That's just kind of how I play. Oh, well, three. I hope you, like, you know, are lying down. Have a nice comfy couch or bed or something. My grass isn't quite growing back the way I wanted to, to um, in that area down below. It's growing back really nicely in the pen, though, which is great. People play the Switch in handheld. I almost just play in dock since I have the Pro Controller. Yeah, I, I tend to play... Um, docked as well, but for Stardew, for some reason, I will usually play that handheld. It just feels really nice. And I think that just is due to the fact that I grew up playing, you know, Harvest Moons on, like, Game Boy and stuff like that. <laughs> okay, those bombs can go away also. I don't want to be hitting myself at my kitchen counter, but my girlfriend forced me to sit down. Good. Very good. Oh, Ark, do you actually find it easier to play the Mario stages that way? That's interesting to know. Mm. Let's put in some more iron. And we'll call it a night there for that day. That finger on the screen though, because... Oh, when you're making the... M right. Sorry, I thought you were, like, playing them. Sorry. <laughs> I should really just be carrying my tools with me. At all times. It's so much easier. Me, I'm gonna eat less sugar. Also me. All oh, the lemon Oreos. Oh, those are good. Um, I haven't had an Oreo in a long time. We're having another good day today, though. Um, I think the last time I had an Oreo... I love how Robin looks like she's asleep. <laughs> was, um... The birthday cake ones. Freeberry, thank you so much for the host. How are you doing? Hi, how are you doing? That's what I just said. I hope you enjoy the gift I've sent you. Well, goodbye, Emily. Sent us a sea urchin. Gosh darn it. Yeah. Playing with controller is sometimes really annoying. Uh, currently bed bound, so I have to play handheld right now. It gets uncomfortable on my side and hold the switch. Yeah. Yeah. I can relate. Can I play as Mario? Well, if you had the mod to- or I guess, yeah, a mod to do it, you probably could. We like Luigi here, though. Oh, whoa, that was dangerous. I could have accidentally hit my potatoes again. Can't say has the birthday cake ones. He loves them. Yeah. I'm not a huge fan, but Mike really, really likes them as well. <laughs> Naruto, yes, it's a dangerous game to lose time in, essentially. Penny and Abigail have the nicest spouses' rooms. I remember Sebastian's a little bit, I think. But beyond that, I actually don't know what they all look like. That'll pro I, like, I really do need to start looking into who I'm gonna marry and properly woo, but... Uh, so yep, Dev, that was multi-tiered. I used to always choose the mushroom cave because the purple mushrooms it gives you are fantastic for the mines and for regening energy. But the fruit bat cave allows you to get those fruits so much faster than planting the tree, actually being able to purchase the tree saplings. Um, and then um, waiting for them to grow and stuff like that. And it was primarily for getting that greenhouse early. That's what I wanted. Yeah, Gamer Pie, it actually does take a little bit of energy. Or, uh, health, I guess.
we go. Animal friends are all happy. Oh, before I forget, this stuff down here has been bothering me for a little while. One right there, and there's one right there. Ooh, I think this is actually all done now. Um, there's just this this one right here, and then we're we're good to go. Double stuffed and chocolate. I'd love lemon or birthday cake Oreos. Yeah, but I only really started seeing the fancy flavored ones here within the last couple of years. Easy to woo, fun storyline, especially if you count the Pam end game thing, which I'm not going to spell. Yes, no, I know about that, but for sure for others. Uh, I'm currently on year two. Um, yeah, why don't we just go down to the mines? I'll bring those bombs with me today again. And I'll also bring some extra food. We're keeping the tree shine? Yes. That tree is my favorite tree. <laughs> okay. I'll put these down here. There's Pam. My goodness, Pam. I was so concerned yesterday. Now I feel like Mike. That's what Mike does, is he finishes stuff on the farm and then he runs to that bus stop at 10 a.m. and then just waits for her to stop and be ready to drive. <laughs> just in case there's anything interesting out here. Gosh. Oh, jeez. Oh, I don't like this level. I don't like this level. I repeat, I don't like- okay. Oh, we got a radium. Yay. <laughs> that was horrifying. I'm a fruit and stardew? Am I? I thought I was always a potato. Penny loves melons, diamonds, and emeralds. Those are the easiest, especially diamonds, which is why I like her. Yeah, it's going to be fairly easy to woo a lot of them now since we have the crystallariums and we can actually make the crystallariums. Uh, getting those diamonds is really easy. I was lucky. Oh. Max, I'm not sure. Probably because I was earlier, but not when you were here. <laughs> oh. Oh, the crystal fruit. True. True. I'd still prefer to be a potato, though. Oh. Mo yeah, with that that Jojo guy. I don't even is that is his name Morris. Actually, make an impact on the world town apart from your farm. In the community center, get restored. I love fixing the bridge on the beach. Yeah, I I'd like to see a lot more of that in future updates. And if this next update is going to be anything like that multiplayer update, I'm expecting more. Oh gosh. Come on, where are you? Oh, there you are. We're getting those, um, spicy eel things, and those are always really good.
Feeling requests like they nothing. Yeah, I'm doing okay, Ark. Oh, here we go. Okay. Let's fall. Fell three levels. Ooh. Got a purple mushroom, which is really good. Yeah, Gupdev, other than like the Egg Festival and that spring dance, which you usually can't even participate in first year, like there's not too much you can do in spring. Stop Mario Maker and start Stardew. You know what? I'm proud. I'm not like, I don't want to stop you from playing Mario Maker, but I'm proud to start people playing Stardew. <laughs> Yeah, Loner Forever. That's what I heard as well, but I do think they're coming out with it soon. It's kind of like a matter of time sort of thing. Ooh, don't put that down. It's how ghost it is, indeed. They, uh, they have a lot of HP, apparently. There we go. Oh, whoops. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> Guns up your beauty, thank you. Um, I hope you enjoy the emotes. Thank you so very much. You now have a heart next to your name in chat. That is so very much appreciated. <laughs> and Panda Lover, I'm sorry that my, my bomb scared you there. There we go, sorry, I'm missing a little bit of chat here. Two seconds, just want to scroll back up and make sure I see everything. Um, found out that I can play Pocket Camp on my Chromebook. Is that any good? I heard lots of hype, but never much about the game itself. Um, I enjoyed the game. I think it's really cute. I think it's well done. But for me personally, it only holds my interest for like two weeks. So, um, I didn't know you could play on your Chromebook, though. That's interesting. Anyway, um, Guns of Verbeety, thank you so very much once again. These guys have such high HP. See my friends list going on Stardew. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry at all, honestly. Stardew is a good game. Okay, way down has appeared. Sammy's playing Splatoon and judging. I thought Sammy was playing some Stardew. Worst thing happened to my Mario Maker look last night. Turn my press on something, he would give me an error message. This morning it's working fine. Huh. Doesn't sound so good. I mean, it's good that it fixed itself, but like. <laughs> I'm assuming you mean Mario Maker. Nintendo servers for Mario Maker were weird last night. They were updating. Oh, that, that would make sense. Ah, uh, yep, Dev, I don't think you do. I don't think you get a, a letter, but it, it takes two in-game days once you've handed it in. Oh, oh no, I'm going down. <laughs> okay, there's a lot of ghosts and a lot of mummies on this floor. Oh, you have to have, um, honestly, go check, <laughs> go check. I usually just use my, uh, my mod to help me out with that. I've gotten very used to it, actually. A little bit bad. I hate floors like this, where, like, there's not a good amount of rocks clustered together for me to use a bomb. There we go. Your computer's been slow today, yeah. I think my homework for after stream, other than playing Stardew, 
is to go see if I can get my old laptop working. It's not really that old of a laptop, and it's a really nice, like, little Asus one. Um, but I want to see if I can get that thing up and running again. For, uh, side purposes on during streams. Um, see... Poppy? Well, saying your name right. Welcome on in. How you doing? Thanks, Stardew, and the game glitched. I completely lost one of my farms. Oh, no. Okay, that scares me. Um, Chainsaw, were you playing on Switch or on PC? Because I know if you're playing on Steam, I think that they have access these days to, like, cloud saving for Stardew. I don't know if that would help at all. Oh, I got an Iridium bar? These slimes are being good to me. PC. Do you know if you have cloud saving enabled for Stardew? I think it's something you do have to enable through Steam, but if you have access to that, that might be your saving grace there. I know I have it turned on because I, I could, like, you know, boot up this save file on a different computer, for example, if I wanted to. Which is really nice. Don't mind if I do. Yeah, I think it's like if you're in your Steam list and you right click on your game and go to... There's either something about cloud saving in there or something in the properties, I believe. It's been a while since I've done it, but I do know that's a thing. Feeling you're progressing really slow because you're only on day nine. I feel like everyone moves at start or in Stardew at their own pace. I just got two iridium bars from that. Um, so like for example, I like to kind of go to bed whenever I feel like I'm done with the day, but I know some people will like stay up until like you know 1:50 a.m. trying to do everything they could possibly do. Radium bar hype. <laughs> Those are really good because that means that we can uh, we can get some more of those iridium sprinklers going. Okay, I was just hoping to get some more, but I thought iridium bars look like soap. They kind of do. you get a you get lower energy the next day yeah i think once you get to a certain point in stardew where like you have a lot of star drops and stuff like that um your energy isn't such a huge deal anymore or when you even get the um uh what should i call it oh i guess i can't pick that up the um bathhouse you don't really have to worry about your energy so much anymore Ooh, don't mind if I do. Eight levels. Yeah, that's gonna actually hurt. I feel like I'm much more likely to get those holes if I actually bomb instead of my pickaxe, so. We got an iridium ore from that, so that's good. Clint gave you furnace blueprints. Very nice. Oh, no, I want that. I want that mushroom. Those are really good to have. Man, I want to go deeper in, but it's already late. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, Adam, yeah. And that's that's another thing, like, sometimes I take forever to do these tasks, other times I'm like, no, I need to get these done right now. Okay, I really want to get down to level 25. And I'm on 23 right now, so... 
I might pass out doing it, but... In terms of my time, but... Yeah. <laughs> so there we go. There was a there was a quiz keys quiz test a uh, test. That's the word that I was trying to accomplish there by getting to floor twenty five. So oh my goodness. Hi. Um. Irel Beatrice. I don't know if I'm saying your name right, but welcome on in. Thank you so much for the follow. I should probably leave now. I'm getting greedy. I'll leave. <laughs> we did really good. That was a really, really, really good dive in. We got what we needed. English is hard. Words are hard. Was I was I kind of not focusing? <laughs> So we got two iridium bars, we got some iridium ore, we got a whole bunch of different items. <laughs> Exhaustion, no. I do the same thing, I creep on uh, Sebastian. Oh, we don't have room for that. Um, I'll start taking these out somewhere else. Um, none of that goes in there. You get four tigers eye from your four magma geodes. Oh my goodness, that luck <laughs> is almost non-existent. Okay, I guess I'll carry that with me. This I'll put in here for now. This goes up here. And that was my food, or my bombs, right? No worries at crossing. Thank you so much for hanging out with us today. And looking forward to the racing tomorrow for sure. Yeah, I got the catfish can be a little bit annoying. There we go. Now we can craft the iridium band. Yep, if not today, I think it might be tomorrow? Maybe? I don't know how long these things usually take. This museum is harder to complete than Animal Crossing? I- Yeah, I could argue. Alright, so we actually got our 10,000 gold back. <laughs> because we spent 10,000 gold upgrading our house, we just got it back for getting to floor 25 of the mines. And we have potato monies coming in today. Um, which means I'm not actually planting any more potatoes. Um, and tomorrow's actually the last day of spring. Potatoes! I still really want mashed potato, you guys. Or baked potato. We were talking about, I think, baked potatoes yesterday? Why do I plant potatoes in spring? Um, I didn't save up for strawberries at the beginning of last year. And I know there's some argument whether potato or cauliflower is better. I always just go potato. I like them better. <laughs> Stretch hair. I could, I could really go for some mashed potato right now. I did have the female scarecrow, by the way. I just looked over and realized. Dale, since you get multiple harvests, see, I think 
you get less harvest from cauliflower, but there's something about like they're worth more per day or something, something like that. I don't know. I'm not too big into that stuff. So I have to get my house and I woke up and I was in a new room in my bed. That means Robin somehow moved my bed into this new room without waking me up. <laughs> That's always a funny uh, thing to happen, Max, yeah. And it's also Strawberry Day. We're gonna earn the Mun Muns today, you guys. I repeat, we're earning the Mun Muns. And you guys get to hear this glorious sound. <laughs> Are you guys debating between tomato and tomato? I have a nasty habit of whoever I'm speaking to, whichever way they're saying it, I'll say it that way. Mike realized it the other day, it was really quite bad. Uh, McMahon, thank you so much for the follow, welcome on in here. Pepper, I do. I do. I have it like, if I'm just by myself, I'll say mom. I usually type mom, but I, I catch myself sometimes and I'll be like, mom. <laughs> yeah, Max, um, the tractor mod is probably one of my favorite mods purely because it feels like it could actually be a part of the game. It's just... Um, you just have to pay for it. It's yuck, that's how you pronounce it. Oh, <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of tomatoes generally either. Mom referring to Jenna, I say mom referring to the woman I live with. <laughs> oh my god, Max. Tomatoes are good in ketchup form, nothing else. I'm cool with like tomato sauce. Or like pastas and stuff. Um, I'll eat cherry tomatoes. Kind of begrudgingly, but I'll eat them. I'm, I'm picky about just straight up tomato though. So sort of like you either you don't or you do. Yeah, my mom like will just slice up a tomato and have that on like toast with like pepper on top and like that's her for breakfast and she's chill with it and I'm like no. No no, we don't do that. <laughs> just eat a tomato whole? Oh my goodness. I mean they're healthy for you, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> like they're apples, she cuts them into slices and eats it? Yep. Yeah. Yep. I feel like I'm missing someone. There you are. <laughs> okay, you guys need to get out of the way of the door now. Okay, one of you out of the way. Excuse, excuse thank you. <laughs> so I've changed my before you had an allergy to them. Oh no. Allergies are dumb. Honestly, I have too many. My body's just like, no, you shouldn't be having this. Um... You're so close to being- oh! You need a tapper. Ooh, Emily's birthday is today. We were actually trying to befriend her, so... Should probably get her something. <laughs>
one allergy and I'm more than okay with it when I hear some experiences, yeah. Um, as far as we know, none of my allergies are really life-threatening, so we're kind of cool with it. <laughs> um, Crystal Emma is fangirling over baby park in the Discord. Emma. I see how it is. Okay. Uh, oh, gosh, that was violent. That's not what I meant to do. Um, <laughs> I wanted to grab stuff for my friends. Random started it. Random. <laughs> Andrew, best of luck. Just get through those ten floors quickly and you'll be okay. Um, who else am I trying to befriend right now? Oh, whoops. So, oh, I'm missing Sebastian. <laughs> During my 90 page essay on my beauty park is an awful course and deserves to be demolished. For anyone who's here for just Stardew and has no clue what we're talking about, Baby Park is a course in Mario Kart. Specifically, we've been playing Mario Kart 8 Deluxe every Wednesday on stream. And Baby Park is a little bit of a sensitive issue on this channel. <laughs> just in case people are like, what? What now? Uh, skill tab. I'm a rancher. <laughs> Robot Ninja, welcome back. How are you doing today? Little key baby park only stream. Stream just about baby park with baby park music in the background. Sammy, you start streaming and you do that. <laughs> I'll come watch, but I won't participate. Lovely well, Liz, hello! Oh, nice, yep, Dev. Oh, wait, is Shane here? No. Eh. Does he go to work today? Um, who else am I trying to befriend right now? I don't think. Oh! There you are, there's your birthday present. So that actually should have put me quite high with her. It did, she's actually now my. Top friend. Allergic to cats. But we end up with a bunch of them, so I think it's caused them to slowly go away over the years. Oh, 100%. I'm a strong believer in, like, you know, if you're slowly kind of exposed to stuff, you can get over allergies. Um, I love watermelon, but I developed an allergy to watermelon when I was, like, four or five. And that didn't stop me, and I still ate it. <laughs> and I'm... Like, you know, I can eat it now without horrible repercussions. Oh gosh, aren't Clint's about to close? That's annoying. Um... Okay, let's go find Sebastian. <laughs> Random. Yep, div, yeah. I'd say. Axe next. If you haven't done watering can. Here's my workout. Cook some pasta and chicken now to chill. That sounds amazing. You and peaches don't mix? Yeah. See, like, if you have a really bad allergy, I'm not saying, like, oh, like, you know, it'll, you'll get over it. Go eat your peach. But, like, if, if it's not a huge one and you still enjoy whatever you're allergic to, for example, I've recently started, for whatever reason, even though I've lived with cats my entire life, started having horrible allergies around them. I'm gonna tolerate it because I really like my cats. <laughs> you're just gonna wait on winter? If you schedule it properly, you can avoid having to wait by, um... If you know it's gonna rain the next day via the, the uh, T 
TD channel and then you put it in that day. The next day it rains so you don't have to water and then the very next day um, you get it back and you can water your crops a little bit late. That's what I do usually do. Lovely Liz, it does. It's a mod I have ongoing right now. They inject you is what you're allergic to? Yeah. And funny enough, funny enough, I stopped kind of having my really, really bad seasonal allergies. Like, I still have them, but not quite as bad. Uh, after I went to have allergy testing done. Um, because they literally just took my arm and essentially exposed it to different types of trees and, and, and pollens and stuff like that. And I, my arm literally lit up. Like a Christmas tree. <laughs> but I feel a lot better now. That could just be placebo. But I'm I'm happy with it. Okay. Uh now we're just waiting on Clint and Sebastian. I don't know when Clint usually leaves, but I do know he heads to the bar. No, lovely Liz, you're not, no worries. Christmas tree arm? Yeah, the doctor walked in, he's like, oh yes. <laughs> That's not good. Three sounds good. Enjoy whatever it is you're gonna be eating, of course. <laughs> Sammy's already calling Shine Thief. Is Sebastian at the bar tonight? To get EpiPen? Yeah. Um, thankfully, nothing that they tested me for turned out to be anything too bad. It was just all, you know, not very nice reactions. <laughs> um, I remember Mike was actually sitting with me while they did it. And of course it's uncomfortable and I'm uncomfortable around needles. But then they left me to sit for like a little while. Um, you know, just testing, making sure that everything is exposed and stuff like that. And my arm, you could just see it <laughs> getting worse. It was really quite bad. Oh, Clint is already in here. There we go. So, Emily and Sebastian are really close. Wizard is next. Clint, Lewis, Willie, Shane, Evelyn. Yeah, we're doing pretty good. Ark, no. <laughs> I don't think it's very expensive. For some reason, 100G is standing in my mind. I don't know if it's that cheap, actually, but... Okay, if Ark is saying it's 100G, I'm gonna assume it is. If <laughs> we're both thinking the same thing. Oh, Pepper, I'm horrified. Like, I... I just huge, huge... reactions to them. <laughs> Everyone here is good. Yeah, you need 10 clay. That's usually what holds me up with getting the silo, is I have to be in the mines more. <laughs> Dogs and cats, I just, just their saliva so I don't mind the reaction very much. Yeah. Yeah, we think mine is also saliva based. Oh, whoops, where am I going? My goodness. Okay, so the pasture is actually filling up really quick with grass, but this area down here, for whatever reason, is just not. Um, trees are looking good over here. We have grass growing this way as well. Perfect. Some dogs, but not to others. Charisma? Yeah, I know there are certain, like, hypoallergenic breeds, but I don't really know what they all are. Ooh. I did something. <laughs> we earned a lot of money. We nearly doubled the amount of money that I had. Oh, 
Oh, Flatty, so you might- ooh! I see what you mean about moving the bed and being in a completely different bed. I have a kitchen. Look at how happy my Judomo is about this. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, guys, you guys know what I'm gonna say. I think I'm gonna end the stream here. I do want to thank you all so very much for watching, though, and hanging out with me. Um, let me see who else is online. Oh, I forgot to give you guys my rant about Chrome and Firefox. Gosh darn it. Oh well. I'll give you the rant later, if I remember. Um, we're gonna go host... We're gonna host Flying on Toast. He's currently playing through some Super Mario Maker 2. I know a couple of you guys in chat were playing that. <laughs> um... Uh oh, give me a second. How do I how do I do this? Uh, here it is. There we go. All right, guys. So thank you all so very much for watching. If you guys are new here, feel free to leave a follow if you enjoyed what you saw. Um, tomorrow we're back at two p.m. EST with some Mario Kart. Um, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all later.